Hello folks, uh, my name's Ed Overstreet and I am here to apologize to Player One. I have been using the Player One Uranus C camera since uh, last Friday and I've imaged every night and uh, I've been live, uh, I think, I think I've been live every night except last night. And yesterday I decided I was going to uh, put the uh, ASI 224 color camera and take the Uranus C camera off because my images have just been uh, soft, lacking any clarity. And I realize I don't have a, uh, I have an 8 inch Celestron edge with a uh, 2X Teleview, the PowerMate, um, it's a multiplier, Barlow, and so uh, I'm limited with optics, but as a baseline, I was getting so much uh, more satisfactory results when I used the 224 camera, which is what I used uh, all of last year, and I thought I got some good images for me. And again, it's relative to my gear and my ability to process. And um, so uh, I, I knew I, I knew there was an answer for the issues I was having to player one, but I couldn't find them. So I'm ready to get rid of it. And yesterday afternoon, uh, I made the swamp. And as soon as the moon came up uh, and I could uh, rose over my home, which was about six o'clock, there's still daylight, but uh, uh, I slew to the moon and I focused with the outside knob on the Celestron. I focused that and uh, had the moon pretty much in focus. Uh, of course, I'm looking at a laptop with a, uh, an old laptop with a, an old screen and and I have old eyes so I did my best job of focusing I thought I'll fine-tune it with my electronic focus so when I get inside and I'm looking at it with a much larger screen and no glare from uh, outside so at any rate I started uh, on Saturn with the 224 and I thought, you know, this doesn't look any better than the player one. And I was racking the focuser in 100, 150, 200 steps. And I was racking it out the same. And I thought, this is something that's not right. So I headed outside. And as I was going outside, it hit me. And I, you gotta be kidding. I bet the clutches have disengaged on the Moonlight Focuser. And if they did, I probably, I did it. That's exactly what's happened. When I when I put the Barlow in, the, the Pyramid in, and I set, oh man, and I set that to zero, uh, or to 1,000 steps, I never tightened those clutches. And so what happens is that I can use electronic focuser and move it in, move it out. Nothing moves, though. So as the evening cooled and the tube, the, the edge, SCT, the scope itself began to cool, my focus got worse. And uh, I just knew something was wrong. It didn't seem like anything I did improved it. So now that I knew it was a clutch, I tightened it down, I reset everything, I went to the moon, I had the player one, I put the player one back on, I slew back to the moon to get a good baseline, sharp focus. It was pretty dark by then and I could see the outside laptop much better. So I knew I had a pretty good focus. Came inside um, and I uh, used my electronic focuser to finally fine-tune focus and so I want to show you 
what I got. And this is the uh, image I took of Jupiter. This is one 5,000 frame image. I didn't take, I usually take between 8 and 10,000 frames. I kept 10% and uh, I processed it in uh, Registax. And so, uh, and I've blown it up a good bit. And, um, and I think for the eight inch edge, uh, well, it looks so much better than what I was doing before stupid here. Uh, it hit him that after five days, I might have a focus problem last, not last night, but the night before last, a friend of mine who happened to be on the stream said, I think it's a, a focus problem. And I said, it may very well be, but I sure don't know how to get it focused. I'm moving one way and moving the other. I just can't get it focused. And I'm thinking, if I can't get it focused, then it's a player one problem. But it wasn't. So, it's me. It always is user error. Uh, rarely ever is it anything but user error. But I was ready to sell the player one, never to use it again. And now I'm tickled to death. So uh, player one, I doubt you'll ever see this review, but should you see it, apologies, because throughout the week I've been mumbling about my uh, dissatisfaction with the Reign of Sea. Well, that's not the case anymore. I'm very happy with it. Uh, so thanks. Uh, I plan to image live tonight, so if there's nothing going on in your neck of the woods, stop by and you can see for yourself um, what Jupiter looks like through the Uranus when the focuser is working. I feel so stupid.